All right, so I've got three B vitamins here, seven, five, and one, which is gonna be your biotin, panothenic acid, and thiamine. All three of these B vitamins are going to be synthesized in the intestine. Always a good idea to get them from our diet too, right? Because um, not sure how um, great they are to use after they've been made by the bacteria. But something to note, B1, 5, and 7 are all synthesized by bacteria in the gut. That's thiamine, panothenic acid, and biotin. Um, another one that's synthesized in the gut that's not a B vitamin is going to be vitamin K. So vitamin K also can be made by gut bacteria. So um, a few other things to kind of point out about vitamins. B2 and B3, when you have a deficiency in one, you likely have a deficiency in another one. Both of these, we talk about the mouth and the tongue, right? So our riboflavin, flavoflav, um, we've got the cracks on the corner of our mouth, dry, cracked lips, sore throat, magenta tongue. And then this one, we have, um, we might have inflammated skin, digestive problems, hyperpigmentation, the beefy red tongue. Um, and then our pellagra, our dementia, diarrhea, dermatitis. So beefy red tongue, um, cracked lips, magenta tongue. Those are our two B vitamins. Um, you're deficient in one, you're likely deficient in the other. Uh, what else do I got for you? I have our, oh, our anemias. So I've got three of them that deal with anemias. We've got... We go six, nine, and twelve. Um, B six, you might just see anemia or the peripheral neuropathy, and this is because B twelve needs B six. Okay, B six. Our B <coughs> nine, sorry, um, megoblastic anemia, microcytic anemia. <clears throat> That's going to be also seen in our B twelve. So B twelve and B nine are both megoblastic and mac microcytic. Um, our big difference here, um, we also have pernicious anemia if you have a removal of part of the bowel. Um, and this can be masked by a folate supplement. And you might see B12 more in elderly dementia confusion versus your folate fatigue diarrhea. Um, so maybe folate, think pregnant women and they're more fatigued, um, maybe have diarrhea, and then our B12, we've got our confused dementia elderly folks who don't have that gastric juice that has the intrinsic factor that's needed. Um, so those are three that have to do with anemia. 6, 9, and 12, remember that. Also with 6, 9, and 12, something important to note is that um, when you're deficient in these, you have an increase in homocysteine. Um, that's bad. Homocysteine increases our risk for cardiovascular disease. So when B6, 9, and 12, when we don't have them and proteins broken down, those protein parts um, form homocysteine. So that's why we need those B12s to kind of scavenger and take those little things away so homocysteine isn't created. Because so we don't have it, increased homocysteine, that's bad, causes cardiovascular disease increase. That's all I got for B vitamins today.